I'm Tyler Snyder from Gaten to Beer Lacrosse. Um, today I wanted to show you guys the Recon XLU, and that's Gate Lacrosse's brand new head for this season. A um, couple attributes that are really nice about this head is a nice long narrow channel, perfect for the college game, the universal player. Just like um, many other gate heads before it, this is going to be one of the lighter heads on the market when it comes to a universal spec. Um, what you do have on this head is you have the three chambers that you've seen from famous gate lacrosse heads like the Torque. Um, what you'll have is you'll have gussets to increase strength and stability. Even though it's a wider head, it's still going to be fairly strong, especially at the bottom and the top of the head. Like many other gate lacrosse heads, we have multiple sidewall holes all the way through it. This is going to make the stick lighter, give you tons more stringing options. Also, the sidewalls will have gradient sidewall technology. Um, in the past, we've done a nice skinny line, just like the torque, all the way through. Due to the increased stresses and demands of a universal stick, we wanted to make it thicker up top and then skinnier line on the bottom. That way, your top half of the stick, you'll be able to tie off those knots with no worries of ripping or pulling any of the plastic, but still keeping it nice, thin, lightweight on the bottom so it's not overly heavy. Comparing uh, the Recon XLU to its brother, the Recon XL, um, again, this is the universal version. We also thinned out the throat of the head. This way it's going to be great for any midi attackmen, face-off guys that want to get their hand up on the head. That way you can get down, clamp it for a face-off. That way you want to slide it up, cradle one-handed, slide it right back down to two. It's a smooth transition to it. Um, the head's very evenly balanced and the way that it is so stiff up top really gets a nice hard snap off it. Here at Gate Lacrosse, Instead of just bringing out one generation after another without improving on the product, we are now taking what we did from the previous year's model and improving on it instead of just widening it. So when we made this Recon XLU, we focused on key changes we wanted to bring over. Number one, to make the head better. And number two, to follow the universal specs. So we made this head much stiffer than our Recon XL but still kept the lightweight and traditional lines and looks. The Recon XLU will have a matte finish to it um, that will not be painted on, it will be done in the mold. That way it won't flake, it won't chip, and it will come in a white, a black, and a gray for you.